this is so embarrassing. So today, I have a couple things that I need to do. It's kind of a mess in my apartment right now. It's very, very messy. It's not like terrible, terrible. Let me show you. The countertop is crazy right now. This stove is obviously crusty, dusty. Coming over to the sink, oh. Sink, not great. The cat food, complete mess. Like what is like clothes that I ordered? Ooh, why? Bathroom. None of this is organized. Like this place is just obviously low key chaos right now. Just even my purse is like, whew. So I clearly have my work cut out for me. I'm gonna start, I think, I was kind of thinking about taking a shower first, but I don't think I'm trying to find the motivation to clean right now. Today is gonna be a productive reset day. I am going to clean up everything that I just showed you. Follow along this one, honestly, if you need to like restart your week, if your place looks a little bit like mine does right now. This, hopefully, if you watch and clean along with me, we'll both get through and start the week off on a really, really great note. First things first, the most important thing for me to clean is going to be the sink. Once the sink is clean, it's really easy to clean off the countertops because then I have space to put any of the dirty dishes away. I can easily load the dishwasher from there and wash anything new that is dirty along the way. All right, it's time to power on through the sink. Look at how gross that drain is right now. On the other hand, it's just food. Oh God. It's a little bit full. Next up is my espresso machine. As much as I love my espresso machine, it does have a couple of extra steps for cleaning out. So first I started by cleaning out the actual espresso pot itself, following by taking out all of the pieces and cleaning those as well. Moving on to the sofa, this was the first time I had taken off all of the couch covers and actually put them in the washing machine. I don't know why I have not done that before, but here I am actually doing it for the first time and it made a huge difference. Bro, what? Oh my God, this is so embarrassing. I have never cleaned under here, obviously. All right, we're gonna vacuum this. Um, especially 
Christine. I am doing this once a month now. It is like brand new. So beautiful. Ugh, I cannot believe how good it looks. I guess it was really dirty and I had no idea because this looks amazing. Okay, so it's a couple hours later. I just got back from dinner. I picked up some Chipotle with my friend. Got a bag of chips, because I have a avocado, so I'm gonna do a little chipsy guacamole, either for like a snack or later. And then I got, I got the tofu bowl with brown rice and pinto beans on this. A little bit of sour cream, no cheese, and romaine lettuce, and the hot sauce, of course. So I'm gonna have another break and eat some dinner, and then I'm gonna continue cleaning. I actually really enjoy cleaning up my space, and I think that's because I make it a little bit fun for myself. Throughout the whole cleaning process today, I either had a vlog on, maybe like the one you're watching right now, or I had a podcast on or some music. So there was like some dancing and singing along to fun things. And I also always made sure that I had water available or coffee or just something fun to kind of drink. I did make sure to eat throughout the day because one thing when you are cleaning is you are doing a lot of steps at the same time and I am not about to get hangry while cleaning. So make sure that you are taking breaks, you're sitting down. I just set a timer for about 15 minutes at a time and then I'll have a little break and I'll get right back to it. All right, last full room of this major, major apartment clean. And then I'm just gonna fold some laundry and I think I'm gonna be done for the night. So I did save the worst for last. We have to clean the bathroom, which means the toilet and the tub and all the crusty dusty hairs and there's a little bit of organizing that needs to go on in here. But honestly, when I clean the bathroom, it actually goes by really fast. So I'm hoping that right now is gonna be about the same. So The next thing I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take everything out from here and then just like pull it out and put the things back in the closet that I need to. And since it's such a tight space, I'm just not gonna show you this and I'll cut forward to when it's actually done. All right, final walkthrough of the bathroom. Oh, thank goodness. It Honestly, it smells and just feels amazing to like walk in here and have it all be like clean and not disgusting. And then this is like all cleared out and I just have my micellular water back here and my daily moisturizer and my makeup bag. Ooh, this is the last thing I have to do is fold this not so bad pile of laundry. This is all I'm gonna show you of my room right now because I'm actually working on a very fun secret project which you all will see hopefully Either the next video or the video after that, just depending on shipping and like realistically building things. I'm not trying to spoil it, but I guess you'll like have to see, but I am going to just like save that for later. Um, so for now, this is all I'm literally showing you of my room. Other things going on in my life, I have not posted a podcast in a very long time because I have just not really been into podcasting. I kind of feel like I got so much out of the first couple that I did and then I was like, I need to be inspired by it and I just, I taking a little break. Honestly, between having a full-time job and doing this, which I love a lot, this I'm gonna let take the full precedent. I'm not saying I'm not gonna podcast anymore because that's not true, I am. It's just right now, taking a little bit of a break because my life is very busy and work has been very stressful. And obviously I'm letting my room get to the point where it was today. I'm so excited to wake up tomorrow and have like a clean space. <sighs> All right, I'm gonna just fold the rest of this real quick. All right, 
So here is a final walkthrough. We have clean stairs. They kind of cleaned up some of the packages over here. Mopped. It's all nice and clean. This has been polished. Everything is put back in its place. Very, very relaxing in here. And the candles smell very fall. Nice and very relaxing over here. I'm pretty impressed. Feels nice to have a clean space. Fresh start to the week. I hope you guys watched and cleaned along with me. So thank you all very much for watching and staying tuned until the end. And I will see you on the next one. Let me know, comment down below what you wanna see next. And I can't wait to hang out with you all again. Have a really beautiful, wonderful day. Bye.